Hey guys, it's Julia and welcome back to my channel and for today's video I'm going to be doing a manga and graphic novel shelf reorganization thing. I have the two shelves behind me, the Stephen King shelf over there, and then on the other side of my room I have one that's just manga and graphic novels, but there's some books on it and there's some- it's a mess. Uh, <laughs> there's some books on it, some old stuff on it, some Funkos that aren't supposed to be there, so I thought I would film myself taking everything down and putting everything back up and reorganizing it, so yeah. Okay, this is the space we're working with. That's, okay. This is the shelf. I gotta clear a bunch of stuff off of it. A lot of this stuff is really old. <laughs> like that good life thing, that's really old. Uh, there's a thing down there that I used in uni. But yeah, let's take everything off of it to start. Completed shelf. The top row, the second row, the third, the fourth row, and the fifth row. Oh, that bothers me. I'll put something here, but that's it without any dec decorations and stuff on it. This is how it's looking with some of the Funko Pops and like little decor pieces on it. I don't know if I should put more, but less, but good enough for now. I have only 
Pusheens there. All my graphic novels going that way. Some more manga at the bottom. Some Junjo Ito Funko Pops as well. Um, I don't have any of his books here with me right now, but I do have a collection of his stuff. Um, yeah, that's what we're looking like right now. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you saw any manga or graphic novels that like caught your eye or that you've read before or want to read, let me know in the comments down below. I'd love to talk about it. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video and I'll hopefully see you soon.